Hi, this is Mark with ValueCharts.com. Let's take a look at the Australian dollar, US dollar cross. We'll notice that this market has been in a wedge pattern here really since almost the beginning of 2011. But uh, notably, we'll see that this market looks like it's finding resistance near the top uh, trend line of the wedge pattern and could be possibly starting to head down to test the lower end, which would take the market all the way down to probably the 96, 97 range over the upcoming weeks. Now, we, we bring this market up right now to talk about a potential break of, of last week's low, which is right around, call it 104.96-ish. If we were to achieve a break of that low, then uh, that could be an excellent sell signal there, and we really don't have to risk a lot here. I'm going to go ahead and remove the drawings here from the screen, but if we were to risk the high of this week, which is right around 105.72, so 105.73, and trade the uh, breakdown of the low, which is 104.96, uh, that could be an excellent uh, sell signal there. Now, we'll notice that the momentum histogram now has started to uh, head south here, has started to go down, uh, and then we also expect uh, that we'll cycle, the MQ cycle finder also has been heading down now for two weeks, and we could see a continuation of the MQ trend index, which would show red histogram bars if this once again started to turn down. Uh, let's take a look at the daily as well. The daily chart here is also showing that uh, last cycle up, last week's cycle up was, was fairly weak. We're now back uh, heading down again with this cycle. And then also we're noticing a red histogram bar, kind of a rolling over of our momentum indicator uh, as well. And then the, the MQ trend index is also showing that this market has either uh, reached a consolidation area or is now officially reversing directions here and uh, possibly heading south. So keep an eye on this market again if we break the low of last week which is right around 104.96 then that could serve as an excellent entry point uh, and then we really should have to risk a lot with that. Uh, we have a long ways to fall if this ends up going down to test the lower end of the wedge pattern.